welcome to the mathematics my channel today we are going to discuss about uh, another interesting point uh, how to evaluate integrals by using mass identity of laplace transform okay first uh, if we talk about mass identity so we know uh, if we have uh, integrals uh, limit should be 0 to infinity and uh, we should have product of two functions product of two functions and uh, limit should be 0 to infinity so we know the mass identity of Laplace transform uh, is uh, this formula uh, here integral from 0 to infinity uh, Laplace transform of f of t times inverse Laplace transform of g of t here dt uh, or ds or dx okay i'm going to take ds okay this is the uh, general formula for mass identity in Laplace transform okay now uh, we are going to solve uh, these two integrals by using this mass identity okay first question uh, first question i am going to take i is equal to 0 to infinity x square minus 1 over x to the fourth power times natural log of x dx okay then uh, here 1 to infinity sorry here limit 1 to infinity now uh, to use mass identity we know uh, we should have limit from 0 to infinity but here 1 to infinity so I am going to take a substitution so if we take uh, t is equal to natural log of x then uh, differentiate so dt is equal to 1 over x dx and uh, we can isolate the x so we know x is equal to e to the t and also we can change the limit we uh, we know a lower limit when x approaches to 1 x approaches to 1 we know t approaches to 0 uh, and uh, upper limit when x approaches to infinity we know t also approaches to infinity okay now uh, we can plug in here so we can write now this is equal to uh, x square so x square is equal to e to the 2 times t uh, now limit 0 to infinity um, e to the 2 times t minus 1 uh, over now x to the fourth power x to the fourth power we know e to the 4 times t and here natural log of x we know natural log of x is equal to t and here dx now dx is equal to x dt so x is equal to e to the t so e to the t times dt okay now uh, we can simplify this so we can write now we know this e to the t get cancelled and here we have now 0 to infinity uh, e to the 2 times t minus 1 over e to the t get cancelled so e to the 3 times t times t here d t okay now uh, we can divide by e to the 3 times t so if we divide by 3 times t we know we will have 0 to infinity here e to the minus t minus here e to the minus 3 times t over t and here d t okay now we can take uh, fx f of t as a e to the minus t minus e to the minus 3 times t and g of t we can take 1 over t okay now uh, we are going to apply mass identity so now we can take uh, f of t so i am going to take as f of t e to the minus t minus e to the minus 3 times t now we know uh, laplace transform of f of t 
is equal to uh, 1 over s plus 1 uh, 1 over s plus 1 uh, minus here 1 over s plus 3 okay then um, I'm going to take uh, g of t you know g of t now 1 over t 1 over t so inverse Laplace transform of g of t we know uh, this is equal to 1 okay now uh, we can take our integral i now i is equal to uh, according to mass identity now limit 0 to infinity now uh, Laplace transform of f of t we know 1 over s plus 1 1 over s plus 1 minus 1 over s plus 3 sorry here s plus 3 and inverse Laplace of g of t we know inverse Laplace transform of g of t is equal to 1 so here d s okay then uh, we can integrate so we know here natural log of s plus 1 minus natural log of s plus 3 uh, limit from 0 to infinity and according to property of natural log we can write this is equal to natural log of s plus 1 over s plus 3 and limit 0 to infinity okay now if we plug in infinity and uh, minus now we can plug in 0 so we can simplify this minus natural log of 1 over 3 okay again uh, according to property of natural log we can write here this is equal to 3 to the minus 1 and minus 1 uh, will come in front of the natural log so here this is equal to natural log of 3 okay this is the answer for first question and we know now this is uh, very easy to evaluate uh, integrals by using uh, mass identity okay now uh, we are going to take our second question so we know our second question is uh, integral from 0 to infinity integral from 0 to infinity uh, sine raised to the 3 power of x over x square dx okay then now I'm going to take uh, this integral is equal to uh, i1 and uh, now to evaluate this integral uh, we can write uh, sine raised to the 3 power of x uh, we can take as f of x so if we take f of x is equal to sine raised to the 3 power of x and we know Laplace transform of f of x is equal to uh, 6 over x to the fourth power plus 10 times x square plus 9 okay then uh, I'm going to take uh, g of x you know then g of x is equal to 1 over x square okay then uh, we can take uh, inverse Laplace transform of g of x inverse Laplace transform of g of x is equal to uh, we know x okay then uh, we can uh, write our integral i1 is equal to we know 0 to infinity uh, sine raised to the 3 power of x over x square dx okay then uh, we can write now this is equal to 0 to infinity uh, according to uh, mass identity we know uh, Laplace transform of uh, here f of x times inverse Laplace transform of g of x dx okay then uh, we can write here 0 to infinity now we know Laplace transform of f of x is equal to uh, 6 over x raised to the 4 power plus 10 times x square plus 9 now uh, uh, we should multiply by 
inverse Laplace transform of gx we know x so we can write here x and here dx okay now uh, we can take a uh, partial fraction so we know now this is equal to 3 over 4 uh, integral from 0 to infinity x over x square plus 1 minus um, x over x square plus 9 and here dx okay now uh, we can integrate so we know this is equal to 3 over 4 uh, times 1 over 2 uh, then here this is equal to we know uh, natural log of x square plus 1 minus uh, natural log of x square plus 9 uh, limit limit from 0 to infinity okay then uh, we we can write here 3 over 8 uh, 3 over 8 and if we plug in uh, upper limit and lower limit we know this is equal to 3 over 4 natural log of 3 okay this is the answer uh, now I know uh, you can understand uh, how to apply uh, mass identity to evaluate uh, integrals uh, limit from 0 to infinity okay if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching